Welcome back to another video, guys. Today we're out here in the orbit. We're catching bass today, guys. Look at that bass down there, right there, right there. You guys see him? You guys see that little baby bass right down there? He's a absolute joint coming right to it right now. Gonna eat and strike. Oh my god, guys. We are about to hook. Oh my god. Look at that. That was just simple as heck. Gold smallmouth, three pounds smally, guys. Are you kidding me? Hey, guys, welcome back to another PJD fishing video. Guys, I'm just messing around with my voice this morning. Uh, guys, look at that. A nice smallmouth. Have you guys ever seen quality smallmouth like this on the map? I haven't. I just caught a four pounder not too long ago, but I didn't record it, unfortunately. So, guys, that was a decent one for this morning. I don't know where we're literally located, so we're going to take a look at that real quick for you guys and show you guys where we're at. We are located right here on the map. It looks like a little wood yard with floating wood everywhere uh, in that little area right there. So it's not too far from the main map on this main little lake still. Uh, it was just off on this little cut here behind this big island. And man, guys, these fish over here are really biting pretty good. It's been a grind today. But I am having a ball, as always, catching them on the spinner bait, as you guys know. And, uh, guys, I don't know what to expect, but we possibly could catch some decent fish today. Oh, my gosh, look at that. Hooked up already. As I'm speaking, it just doesn't end on this game, I swear. I pull up on a spot, and I start catching them left and right, and you guys know how it's done. And we get them in the boat. Even though we're not on the boat today, we're on land, but we get them in, baby. So let's get this fish in. Let's see how big it is. Possibly another good one. Obviously, today the main goal is to catch as many fish as we can and possibly catch a few big ones. As you guys know, we like catching them big ones, but you never know when you're going to catch them. So let's hope we get um, a few good ones today. Come on, baby. Possibly a good smallmouth. Oh, little, 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 little largemouth. Holy cow, that's really small. Let's get that one back in the water and let's take a look in the water. It's kind of cool here because you can kind of see a little bit uh, into the water here. Earlier, I seen a that other smallmouth as you guys saw. But I saw an even bigger one over here earlier. I'm not too sure. Let's flip out in front of this little dock area, see if there's any fish. Just right here locally, right next to us. Don't know, but you never know. Look at that, guys hooked up right there yep 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 we're already hooked up holy cow that fish came flying across guys and ate it right there another quality quality little large mouth not too bad a little bit bigger than the last one but not the best so let's see if we can get uh, a bigger one over here i'm probably gonna move around in just a second but let's see if we can get a quality fish off this floating dock over there uh, i'm not too sure there's a big stump out there in the water but if you guys look all the way across on the left hand side there's just floating logs everywhere and i think there's probably some good quality fish sitting around those so we're going to take a look in just a second after i catch another fish right now maybe maybe not let's see let's see you guys think it you think we'll get one you think you think i don't know come on i love when we get that strike but it's always so unexpected when the water's like this you can't see that well that distance but when they're up close you can definitely see them fish following it so Let's see if we can get one here. Probably. Oh, there's a fish that just came up right there. That's a little, little fish, but you never know. I'll take a little one right now. But I sure would like a good begging. Guys, something about me you might notice is uh, I love making funny uh, funny voices pretty most, most of the time. Whether I change my voice, uh, add to it. Oh, hooked up. And I just like to make different noises, different voices, and just kind of be a goof. So... If you guys get annoyed of it, it's okay. I'm just going to keep doing it anyway because it's funny. So let's let's make a move because that was a little bit ridiculous. But uh, I, I don't know why we couldn't get a good bite. So as you guys can see, this is a giant, I don't even know. It is a blank and co millwork lumber area. So that's why all this lumber is here. See all the standing lumber, We're chopping it down and probably bring it in for people to use for homes to be built used for other uses so let's see if we can get a bite off this post right here i like that how it looks right there pass over to them logs uh, i don't know how we're bringing it through the logs but i know a while back when we were playing this game my buddy and i as you guys know spencer tv he actually had caught a six pounder fish in these logs one of the very very first times we started fishing playing this game together 
And, man, it was super, super cool. I missed out on catching one because I had to leave early, but he got a good one. So I'm hoping today uh, we can get one that size. Possibly, possibly not, but you never know. So we are going to see what we can do as always. Wow, kind of surprising. Nothing on that cast. I don't understand why. Let's go to the edge of this dock. Let's cast towards this brush across the way. Vegetation mixed with the lumber. I guarantee... Oops, can't cast on to land over there. I bet that we'll catch one over here. I almost guarantee it because it just looks so structurally inclined for fish to be around. It's a good structure for home. They're sitting there underneath or they're just waiting to bombard some bait in here. The only thing I don't like about this area is there's not a lot of current, guys. Not a lot of current at all. I don't understand. It's probably because we're so far behind the main lake. There's not a lot of wind blowing here. There's not a lot of current flow. So that's the only thing that might stop us from catching fish like we were in the last episode. That was crazy. Cast after cast after cast. But you never know. you got to venture to find fish. And once you find them, oh, guys, there's one big one coming at it right now. Let's see if he eats strike let's go we're hooked up again guys let's go i don't think it's that big but it was cool to watch swim across the screen and eat it let's get it in yes let's see hey we're getting bigger we're getting bigger juvenile largemouth not bad good color on that fish quality quality little largemouth right there i every cast as of right now we have been getting bigger and bigger gosh what the heck's going on Hopefully, why can't I cast, guys? I think uh, the rod is, like, glued to me or something. What the heck? I don't know. So let's see if we can get a, another quality fish in. Maybe a bigger one. Possibly a three to four. Oh, hooked up. Hooked up already. Let's see if this fish is giving a lot more of a fight. It looks like it is already. Uh, maybe not. Coming in pretty quick at 100. So it's probably even smaller, possibly around the same size. Yes, let's go. Let's see. Oh, perch. Oh, my gosh. The bass could be eating those perch. That's what we're looking for. We're looking for a bass that big that's going to eat that perch. Let's cast out by this main rock over here. See if there's any big fish sitting on that rock. Could be an absolute stud sitting out there. Almost like a little point mixed with some grass on the backside. Perfect ambush point for a fish. There's a little bit of wind coming across, so maybe some current, guys. I'm not sure, but... That's one thing in this game uh, that you do see on the rivers for sure is there all, there certainly is a lot of current, especially once you're right by those waterfalls. But uh, it does make it tough to fish for sure. But you definitely get bit a lot more than what I'm fishing right now, which is kind of interesting. So we will see. Today might be a shorter day. I don't know, but I'm hoping that we can catch some fish. If not, we're going to have to make a solid move because as of right now, it's not producing as well as I hope it would. All right, that was kind of cruddy right there. So we are actually, you know what? Let's make a full, full, full move. So let's go to the map. Let's take a look. See where we're at on the map. We're all the way over here. I'm going to go actually to one of my favorite spots for you guys. And we are going to go give it a try as we always do. Let's go see what we can do. Nope, it's not that one. I'm pretty sure it's this one. All right, let's go take a look. All the way on the east, east side of the map. Way back in this little nook over here. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -ba -bum. I'm going to run there. And once I get to the spot, we will start fishing. I'm pretty sure it's just up here to the left and we go way way back for those of you that have watched my previous videos this is probably somewhere you've seen me fish before definitely a fish producing area kind of a secret spot but definitely uh, a spot that you guys have seen you know where it's at so if you need to catch fish or you're needing to have fish in a day definitely fast travel here because you will catch some solid fish it's just about patience and timing and uh, you just never know. So we're going to fish these lily pads quick. And then we're going to go to the back of the pocket. Uh, hopefully we can catch a good one out of these lily pads. Because it always is typically a producer for me. Not too sure what to expect right now. 
but the day is getting shorter and there looks like there's a bass right there guys you see him oh yeah let's see if we can catch that baby I don't know for sure but I think, oh strike hooked up guys not the fish I was looking at but we are hooked up let's turn up that drag a lot see if we can get this fish in he is putting up a fight but I think it's because there is a bunch of vegetation not too much fight probably a small bass if I had to guess maybe a rainbow let's see let's see guys come on baby what the guys i don't understand every time i think it's gonna be a bass it's the complete opposite species oh my gosh it's a freaking sauger if you guys don't know what a sauger is it is basically a walleye and um i don't know if you guys pay attention in the world or seen the news lately but there was a huge huge scandal on the actual professional walleye tour of professional anglers cheating by putting lead weights and fish fillets inside actual fish to make them seem bigger than they were supposed to be and they got caught and now are actually going to jail had all their boats and all their things taken for investigation and are really really in big big trouble might not I'm pretty sure they aren't ever going to be able to fish again. The most unethical thing ever done in the sport of fishing, I believe. Here we go, guys. Another fish. There we go. That's the fish we're looking for. See, we upgraded a little bit there. Two pounder. Can't can't beat that right there. Let's go. So let's cast a little bit to this side. Let's see if I can. Oops, can't do that. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know. No. But guys, yeah, it was insane. These guys were just the biggest cheaters in all of fishing. We're hooked up again, guys. If you haven't seen it, you should go check it out. Boom. A little uh, mountain whitefish. I don't understand why those are in the game, but some people like to catch them. So I don't. But if you do, props to you because they're just the most tedious fish. I think the most tedious fish in this game by far are the mountain whitefish and hooked up again and the mountain whitefish and the perch i think those are the most tedious fish to catch in the game because they're so small and when they appear in the game they look so much bigger than what they actually are but hey it's still a fish you just still catch them so it's still kind of fun come on get in here baby Yee. uh exactly my perfect that was speaking to the devil right there i was Talking about the perch, making him feel bad about himself, and the next thing you know, I catch him. So, oh well, it is what it is. Let's see if we can sight fish some fish up in here. Typically, you can see some swimming. There's two right there. One a bit way over across. Let's see if we can catch him. Let's, let's slow this bait down just a bit. See if that fish will come up and bite. Come on, baby. You hungry. You know you're hungry. Yep, come on. You know you're hungry. There's a little one right there. I don't know what that is. Probably one of those little bluegills or a perch or... Nope. Nope, nothing there. Let's keep, let's keep working our way back. Possibly could see ourselves a giant bass. Be kind of sick if we did because water is some of the clearest water in the game. There is one portion of this map that has the clearest water I have ever seen in the game, and it is actually pretty neat. Um, I'll have to take you guys there sometime. It's super, super blue water. The water is very, very strange. I don't know why it is that way, but you cannot literally catch any fish there. It's like a glacier. It's so odd, and um, yeah, I'm not too sure. I've never been able to catch fish there. I'm sure there are fish in it. I don't know what kind of fish, but I just have never been able to catch them. So we'll have to take you guys there in a future episode. Um, and if you guys like these episodes and you guys are wanting to see more, any uh, comments or anything down, written down below for me to produce videos for you guys for what you guys want to see, I would gladly appreciate it. As well as if you hit that like and subscribe button, uh, to watch these videos um, would mean the world. So if you guys want to see more of these videos, just keep hitting that like button and also get your buddies or your friends to subscribe because 
I'm not going to stop. I'm going to keep them coming for you guys. So we're going to keep going and we're going to keep trying to produce the best games in the best videos in this game for you guys. Uh, but also uh, another thing is there is an upgrade in this game that's coming uh, on Halloween, actually. So it will be pretty, pretty neat. I'm going to try to get that update, see what update comes to the game. And possibly there'll be some cool changes so that we can actually catch some, maybe some bigger fish, or some changes in possibly some rods, some reels, and maybe different stuff to the map. So we'll definitely have to see, and I'll get you guys up to date with the update. Um, possibly if you have the game too, don't forget to update it on Halloween because it is going to be a sweet update on the game. I think it's the first total brand new upgrade. So. Uh, it'll be a little bit of a change, but I don't know what to expect, but I'm excited to see what Call of the Wild, the angler, has come up with and uh, wanted to make changes to the game that they already came out with. So, it'll be good. It'll be a very good situation. Well, I'm sorry guys. I'm really not producing today. I caught some fish, some small fish, not too many big fish, but uh, let's try to get one more for you guys and then we'll probably call it a day out here. I'm getting super tired. I didn't eat breakfast this morning and I'm getting super low on energy. I need to go back home, rest up to get back out here tomorrow. I'm thinking I'm probably going to take the boat out tomorrow. I'm not too positive, but it'll be a great, great day for it. Weather's supposed to be perfect. Everything's supposed to set up right. So let's cast w one or two more times back in this lily pad clump. And let's see if we can get our... If, if I can cast. <laughs> let's see if I can get... What the heck, guys? I don't understand. Why am I doing this? Okay, guys. I think I should quit. I think I should quit. I really can't cast. You guys know why I can't cast? Because I really can't cast. Oh, my gosh. Okay, that's six times. There we go. Holy smokes, guys. I felt like I should just quit fishing or break my fishing rod at that point. I couldn't cast seven times in a row. My gosh. That's unbelievable, guys. All right, so let's see if we can get one more for you guys. Hopefully, it's a good one. I don't know, but either way, every day is a great day to be on the water fishing, getting that rod on the reel in the water. And just learning about nature and producing the best stress-free thing in life. And that is catching fish. I 100% feel that that is the most fulfilling thing in my eyes. And it is unbelievable when you catch fish. All right, guys, that was a bust. Let's go run up here real quick, really, really quick. I'm trying to catch one more for you guys. I, it's a struggle right now, but I am really on the grind. It is it is almost time for night night for me, uh, but I need to eat dinner first and get some rest, guys, like I was saying. But, man, this is, this is one of the toughest days I've had in the game, and I can't cast to save my life. Holy cow. All right, come on, baby. Let's see if we can get one more fish in the boat or land, as we are calling it today. So, I don't know. Oh, guys, there's one right there. Hooked up. Let's go. Okay. This one could possibly be the biggest one of today with the... I don't know, guys. What do you think? What do you think? Is it a bit... Oh, my God. Turn that drag down. Guys, this is a giant. This could possibly be a stud. This... Fish is pulling crazy drag right now and if I turn up the drag it will freaking break and I don't want to let that happen so let's try to get this fish in I don't know if it's a bass it came up and ate just like a bass would and I don't know it could be a largemouth could possibly be a smallmouth or it could be a rainbow trout I'm hoping it's a big bass what do you guys what do you guys think what do you think I don't know come on baby get over it looks like a bass in the water it looks like a bass it's acting like a bass. It's fighting like a bass. When you catch bass in real life, you'll feel head shakes, but I can't feel them. So let's go. Almost in. Almost in. Come on. Yep. Yep. Get over here. Yep. You're so close. Just get in. Come on. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. Holy smokes, guys. That's not a bad one. That's the biggest one of today for sure. 
a four pounder, almost five pounds, large mouth right there. Silver one, not a gold, but man, that is not bad at all. Well, we're going to end on a high note today, guys. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Again, hit that like and subscribe button if you like to see more videos. And thank you for watching another PJD fishing video, and we'll catch you in the next one.